sure he would love to have that back in his hands, but we'll have to see tonight if he can get through Mortar, as I said, who is undefeated in singles competition since winning that title. But if anybody can do it, it's gonna be my man, Adam Booker. We saw Adam Booker make a uh, comeback at the chaotic countdown, but this is his first singles match in at least over a year. Adam Booker saying, Mortar's gonna kill me? We'll see about that. You know, there's an old saying I love, Pat, called time is a flat circle. The idea being that the more things change, the more they stay the same. Mortar, of course, won the New England Championship from the Smoke Show, Ricky Smokes, at the 2022 Boston Brawl in a brutal ladder match. Adam Booker faced off against Chase Del Monte in a ladder match for the New England Championship at the PAV in one of the most legendary matches in that championship's history. These men's reigns as New England championship, as New England champion, run parallel to each other in so many ways. Absolutely. That's an excellent point you made there, Jordan. But of course, Adam Booker has the experience that Mortar does not have. We'll see if that comes into play. You mentioned Adam Booker hasn't had a singles match in damn near over a year. I mean, Mortar has been wrestling week in and week out every time there is a chaotic wrestling show. It doesn't matter where in Massachusetts or New Hampshire we're talking about. Mortar is there, and he's defending that New England title. I, 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 Jordan, I've seen Adam Booker go away and come back a few times. Whenever he makes his return here to chaotic wrestling, it's like he hasn't skipped a beat. And look at him right now, dominating already in the outside of the ring here. Making me eat my words, making Mortar eat a chop to the chest. He, Adam Booker has been, in my opinion, oh. the most technically sound performer in the history of Chaotic Wrestling. Right now, though, Mortar looking to fly. Tope Suicida from Mortar cracking our ringside guardrails in two. Hey, Pat, you remember that old Wendy's commercial, The Old Lady? Where's the beef? I, th I think we found the beef here with these two men, suffice it to say. I don't know what to make of that reference right there, Jordan, but that was an amazing suicide dive by Mortar, and now he's laying him in on Adam Booker. Raining shots down to the head of Booker here. Big boot to the face. Breaking the count. And really rallying the Watertown faithful behind him. A, a healthy and respectful reaction, reception, I should say, for Adam Booker, but these fans love Mortar. He has earned their love, he has earned their support, and it'll be interesting to see if that is what carries him on to championship retention as he's taking a trip around the world. Oh! Adam Booker catches him and slams him into that guardrail. We're gonna need to order new ones after this New England Championship match. Just incredible. Always has an eye on the competition, whether he's down and out or on top. Adam Booker saw Mortar coming, caught him and slammed him right into the corner barricade Pat, our, on our, top of one of our security guards. Is our security's been knocked out cold. Is that funny to you, Jordan? It's a little funny to me. It's a little funny to me too, okay. Glad we could agree on something. As Adam Booker here, back in firm control, the tide of this thing has shifted in a big way, cracking Mortar upside the skull with that guardrail, and now deposits him into the laps of our fans at ringside. We love all of you watching along at twitch.tv backslash chaotic wrestling, but you gotta be here in person. You gotta see what it's like at chaotic wrestling. Just raking Mortar's face painted dome across that guardrail here. Wow, Adam Booker is vicious, man, huh? You're telling me. I, t I was trying to warn you. I never dust uh, doubted, I should say, the, the merit, the medal of Adam Booker. Oh, 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 man. Oh, man, leg drop to Mortar! Classic Adam Booker with the guillotine leg drop off of the barricade! 
I think he might have taken himself out with that one. Certainly, most of the damage went on to Mortar, whose head basically got cut off. It's, it, it's double damage. Not only his head getting cut off, but also his, his, his rib cage, his abdomen, getting all that force, all that pressure, all that weight slammed into the guardrail. A double whammy of punishment for the New England champ. And I don't mean this as a knock. Adam Booker is a, a, a 23 plus year, 25 year veteran of the wrestling scene. And he, he's up there in age, he's, he's at least in his 40s. So, you know, that's not gonna go easy on the body, the toll that that guillotine leg drop took on him. We'll see how he recovers from that going forward. Manages to roll Mortar into the ring, looking to capitalize here. Bit of a lackadaisical cover. I think Booker knew after all the time between that guillotine leg drop, rolling Mortar into the ring, and then finally going into the cover. Probably wasn't gonna put away the New England champion, instead opted to uh, toy with him a little bit, perhaps. Take a look, Jordan. I mentioned he's the most technically sound performer I've seen in Kyoak Wrestling. Look how Adam Booker works around this ring. Look how he uses the ring to his advantage. He knows every inch of the ring like the back of his hand, and he's gonna make you pay for it. Using his head, drilling it into the abdomen of Mortar, that same abdomen that just got squished against the guardrail moments ago. You want to talk about knowing things like the back of his hand, he just used the front of his hand to chop the chest of the champ. Mortar, I haven't seen him look so defeated since he's been New England champion. Right now he's crawling around the ring, gasping for air. Yeah, I gotta be honest, Mortar with one hell of an impressive New England championship reign, but the fight that Adam Booker's put up so far, the domination we've seen from Booker, I, I would not be shocked if Mortar's greatest New England champion dreams went up in smoke here tonight. Now Adam Booker lifting Mortar up into the corner, throws him to the opposite side with a hard whip, knocking out Mortar once again. Unbelievable, Adam Booker, just absolutely incredible. The word methodical comes to mind when calling an Adam Booker match. Absolutely. Cover here. You nailed it right Dude. in the head there, Jordan. Only a two. It's Adam Booker who's nailing Mortar in the head. My point being that Adam Booker slows the pace down to molasses. He takes his time. He doesn't let the frenzied offense of Mortar get to him. He doesn't let this lukewarm to negative reception from the chaotic faithful get to him. Absolutely not. When he's in control, he really is in control of the people, of the crowd, and of course, of Mortar. Went for the splash there, but Mortar caught him with a boot to the face. And just sits out on him. Mortar looking to find his second win, looking to find his way back into this thing. Went for the lariat, but get caught. Adam Booker drilling him down. Hooks that leg, we can have a new New England champ. No, not quite three, but he definitely cut off whatever momentum Mortar was trying to build there once again, proving he is as methodical as, as we say. He is unbelievable, Adam Booker. Did, did I say enough good things about Adam Booker? He's more than earning all of them right now. I can go on. And this is really gonna be the great equalizer, I think, for, or shall I say, against Adam Booker. The fans chanting, you can't beat him. You got to see if Booker can get that out of his head. Hey, what is this? What's he doing? That, that's wrist tape. Adam Booker pulled out of the, I believe pulled out of his knee pads here. He's tying, is he tying his hands? Mortar's, Mortar's wrists are already taped. I, I don't know what he's doing here. I think he just wrapped the, the tape around both of their wrists together. He's, he's taped, this is not a, a strat match. It's not a dog collar match. These athletes are not legally to be tethered to one another. I'm not sure what Mortar has in store here. Mortar doesn't have anything in store. Excuse me, what Adam Booker has in store. I don't quite know either. I've never seen this from Adam Booker. It's, it might be smart strategy though from Adam Booker if referee Kevin Quinn is to allow it, which at least for the moment he seems to be, because Mortar is known to take to the skies. He's known for those springboard moonsaults, those top rope cross bodies. It's not gonna be very easy for him to do that if Adam Booker is tethered to the man. He's always thinking Adam Booker. A deadly combination of cerebral intelligence and dominant power. Yes, he is. 
When Adam Booker made this challenge, he said, you don't get to become the longest reigning chaotic wrestling New England champion without first going through me. And he's living up to that here. Mortar willed on by the chaotic faithful, the Watertown fans finding a way back into this. Kick to the face, but an elbow shot from Booker levels him. Mortar trying to escape. Both of these men knowing each other so well, they've clearly done their homework, and both Booker, challenger, and Mortar, champion, collapsing to the ground as Kevin Quinn tries to release the two from each other's grasp. Mortar's gonna find his way to his feet if he wants to have any chance of making a comeback here. Same for Adam Booker, these two tit for tat. Mortar's found his way back. I wouldn't say tit for tat, Jordan. Adam Booker's been dominating for the past five minutes, for a good five to six minutes. Well, it doesn't matter what was happening five or six minutes ago, because right now, this is all mortar here. Springboard crossbody. Uh-oh. He's on wobbly legs. Watch out, Adam. But Mortar's still in this thing, thinking F5-5. Oh, no. But Mortar just crumples under the weight of Adam Booker after everything the challenger has put him through. It's too much for the champ. Oh, super kick out of nowhere. That wasn't too much for him. And now he's pointing to the sky. You got to think he's going to be climbing those ropes. That's what I said. The power is apparent, but it is the agility, the athleticism, the high-flying acumen of the champion that secured him 420 days with New England gold around his waist and right now. Once again, Adam Booker always keeping an eye on the competition, letting him, excuse me, not letting Mortar make any aerial attack. Keeping a little more than an eye on him here, raining down, clubbing blows to the back, and he's not. I'm not thinking super flex here, Pat. No. I don't think Mortar's gonna let that happen as he's fighting out of it. Headbutts traded back and forth between these behemoths. And now, Adam Booker. Come on, this, this is not wise. This is not a smart move. Not against Mortar. Not with this much on the line. Not at this juncture in the matchup. Uh-oh. Thunderclapping Booker here. What's he going to do? Adam Booker's in the tree of woe, and Mortar thinking double foot stomp. Ouch. Now what's he doing? Springboard moonsault. Mortar retains. No. There we go, Adam Booker, but daddy's still in this thing, Jordan. Mortar was a second, a second away from securing his place, from realizing his destiny as the greatest and longest reigning New England champion in chaotic wrestling history. Do you like cliches, Jordan? I don't need a cliche. We're, we're seeing. Well, I'm going to give you here. one. Close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. And unfortunately for Mortar, that was just close. This might feel like a hand grenade. Adam Booker with a power bomb, and he's not done. Styles clash here. Adam Booker, New England champion once again. No. Adam Booker was using that move back in the. Early days the early of his odds, career, if you will. around the year 1999, and I'm not kidding, go on YouTube, folks, I saw it myself. He hit that move once and the crowd went, what the heck was that? Adam Booker aging like a fine wine here tonight, but will it be enough to uncork the championship reign of Mortar? Knees and elbows to the face, and now Booker, we're gonna put him away perhaps, but Mortar lands on his feet. When we know Mortar, no stranger to up north, was thinking Canadian Destroyer. But Adam Booker, just too big, just too strong. I am just getting an urge that Mortar's tile reign is coming to an end here tonight. And there it is, the Book Daddy Driver. Looking to close the book on Mortar's championship reign. No! Are you kidding me? Did Mortar really just kick out of the Book Daddy driver? I can hardly believe it, but we see it live in living color, HD 720p on Twitch.tv. 
<laughs> Even Kevin Quinn is shocked. You hear the chants from the Watertown faithful, undisputed. I, I mean, it's kind of hard to argue. He's undefeated as New England champion so far in singles competition, and he just kicked out of the Book Daddy driver. I'm a little worried. What does Book Daddy have left? Yeah, that's a game-ending maneuver. Oh, my God. Adam Booker's going to look to put Mortar away with his own F55, I believe. The champion not going to stand for that disrespect. Instead, going to show him how it's done. F55. Five. It's gonna take a little, it's gonna need to take a little more than that. Look, Booker's back up to his feet immediately. Mortar with a double tap. Call it the F-10-10. Hooks that leg. Mortar is the greatest New England champion in company history. Here is your winner. And now, officially, the longest reigning New England champion in chaotic wrestling history, Mortar! Tommaso Ciampa, Fred Rosser, Matt Taven, Carmelo Hayes, formerly known as Christian Casanova, Dijak, the list goes on and on and on of former New England champions. But after tonight, at the very top, the cream of the crop is mortar. Can't argue that. I hate to see him beat my boy Adam Booker, but you gotta give the devil his due mortar. Just absolutely dominating the scene here for well over a year and a half. Unbelievable. And listen, credit where credit's due. Adam Booker did not win the day here tonight. But I said early on, this might be Mortar's greatest challenge to date as New England champion. Oh, hold, hold on, Jordan. Absolutely his A greatest challenge. A hold on, Adam Booker's calling Mortar back in the ring. Are we, are we gonna see round two? <laughs> I don't, I mean, no one Adam Booker, I think so. Passing of the torch. A seal of approval coming from Adam Booker, acknowledging the greatest champion, excuse me, New England champion in chaotic wrestling history. <laughs>